Generally, corporate directors aren't required to give advance notice of regular board meetings or specific agenda items to be brought up at those meetings. In the 2002 case Adlerstein v. Wertheimer, the Delaware Court of Chancery considered whether corporate directors could remove a controlling shareholder who was also a director at a board meeting without first informing that individual of the proposed plan. In 1992, Joseph Adlerstein founded Spectrumetics Corporation, or SMC, a Delaware corporation headquartered in State College, Pennsylvania, that manufactures genetic and pharmaceutical equipment. Around the same time, Stephen Wertheimer and Judy Mencher, two investment bankers, were introduced to Adlerstein and were later elected to SMC's board of directors. In 1997, SMC went public, but experienced substantial losses soon after. Based on Wertheimer's advice, SMC hired Manis O'Donnell, an independent management consultant, to examine the company's management and finances. O'Donnell rendered a report concluding that unless SMC began selling more equipment, it only had enough cash to continue operations until late 2001. In 2000, based on Wertheimer's advice, SMC once again hired O'Donnell to examine SMC's management and finances. O'Donnell then updated the previous report, concluding that SMC only had enough cash to continue operations until early 2001. One year later, SMC hired O'Donnell for a third time. O'Donnell concluded this time that Adlerstein was the problem because he was, quote, totally lacking in managerial and business competence and has demonstrated an unwillingness to accept these shortcomings, unquote. Further, O'Donnell stated that for SMC to survive, Adlerstein had to be removed from his management role. Wertheimer and Mencher then formulated a plan with Elon Reich a wealthy investor, to remove Adlerstein from the board. Under the plan, Adlerstein would be fired. A separate entity affiliated with Reich would be created and given new stock constituting a majority of SMC's voting power, and Reich would be appointed as chief executive officer and chairman of the board. Without informing Adlerstein, Wertheimer presented the proposal during a board meeting in 2001, and over Adlerstein's objections, the board approved it. Following approval, Reich used his majority control to remove Adlerstein from the board via shareholder consent. Subsequently, Adlerstein sued Wertheimer, Mencher, Reich, and SMC in the Delaware Court of Chancery, seeking to declare the actions taken by the board as invalid. Specifically, Adlerstein argued that the 2001 meeting wasn't properly noticed and convened, and therefore all actions taken in conjunction with the meeting were null and void. The case went to a bench trial.